So my dear friends, good morning from Electric Uncle Hat Wale. So we are going to start with now next part with this Putty software. What I told you in my previous video, we will need IP address finder as well as uh, putty and VNC server and viewer software, three softwares to start with the things. Hmm? So about the putty, how we will set our Raspberry Pi after having written the Raspberry Pi OS 32 on our SD card. Correct. So I will show you how to download your putty software and all together VNC server also I will tell you because both are parallel. Both you have to install at a time then starting with from the putty we will set our Raspberry Pi in putty cmd you can say terminal command so let us proceed and enjoy and we request to subscribe and share this channel it will be indirect help to the needy students especially preferably who are under poverty line i want my videos to get it reached to them from my free education platform. That is what at this age I need, I want. It will give me the satisfaction. So let us proceed. So my dear friends, we will start first with VNC viewer on our laptop. How to get it installed, right? So I have a folder, I have written all the links which I need <coughs> for processing. So now we will choose from here. This you will find in my description, this link for the viewer, not server. You have to install viewer on your laptop because you want to view your Raspberry Pi on your laptop. And server will be configured on Raspberry Pi. So. We can start it now. Just copy paste or just click my link in my description, you can find. And direct start downloading and installing it. First, get it downloaded. It takes much time, so I have edited the video. I have cut it. You need to wait with patience. Select your window system and come to download VNC VR. There is server also, but uh, if you want to display your computer on another computer, then you need this server. Otherwise not. You want to display your Raspberry Pi on your laptop, just VNC VR is enough. So get it download. Watch it. Now it is getting downloaded. Afterwards, we will install it. So there is still it is downloading. Hmm. So next part will come of installation and uh, during installation it will ask the things you want English, okay. Then accept the agreement, click it, okay. Then you can select here, yeah, accept the terms, hmm. okay. Then you can choose here desktop shortcut also. And next, and it will get start. That's it. Now, it will be ready to view your Raspberry Pi. Just we will fill up the IP address of our Raspberry Pi. And which I have told you how to get IP address of the Raspberry Pi in my previous episode. Or otherwise, on any screen if Raspberry Pi is playing, you just click on the icon, Wi-Fi icon on the top right side top 
there you will find icon just click it and you will find IP address so it has been installed but before moving I always insist and show in my every video just configure your video uh, this Raspberry Pi maximum in starting before writing it on the SD card just press Control, shift and x one screen will appear before writing command just fill up that uh, form so that your wi-fi will be connected automatically with your raspberry pi ssh enable it this is default raspberry pi dot local or uh, pi and this is raspberry pi password default and here is wi-fi address of my home and this is password at your home whatever it is then asia calcutta region so that it will show the correct time as per your region so just these are the advanced options so do it so now you start writing and your raspberry pi is perfect to use and just plug your raspberry pi sd card insert it in your raspberry pi give a supply of 5 volt from the official adapter of raspberry pi you have to be very careful for the supply it need exactly 5.2 volt right so always use official adapter of the raspberry pi for this 5 volt supply so just make it ready and now the wi-fi is being connected you cannot see but the, it will appear in the putty and vnc server so now we will proceed with next step go there is the putty we will download it and the description of this putty software you will find it in my description so just click there and download it and make your raspberry pi ready after being configured so here is the site you open it these are all free softwares okay it is written at the top to download it you can download putty here putty is an ssh so it will configure your raspberry pi just select 64 bit into 86 from here at the top and get it start installing after installation we will open cmd screen and just fill up little bit and it will configure our raspberry pi automatically keep your raspberry pi on with the supply yes, now we are here we will open putty it is in my taskbar installed this is the installation i have already installed but i have to show you i am doing it all i just got repair you need to install right now here is the putty you see just i will open it and we will put ip address of our raspberry pi correct my raspberry pi address is 192.168.1.20 so that you can find in the existing screen also just uh, clicking on the icon of wi-fi on the screen you will get that ip address and there are other methods also now it is open okay put pi login as pi and the password is the same default raspberry pi and just here you need to write sudo raspi dash configure this much only you have to do now this screen opens from here you can select interface options you know remember this putty is configuring your raspberry pi now select ssh yes 
ओके नाउ सेलेक्ट इंटरफेस देन बी एन सी एनेबल येस ओके सो दिस वी डीड इन द रासबेरी पाई बिफोर विद एग्जिस्टिंग स्क्रीन इन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो सेम वी हैव टू कॉन्फिगर थ्रू विद द हेल्प ऑफ पुटी नाउ इट हैज बीन कॉन्फिगर्ड वी विल कम बैक टू अवर वी एन सी सर्वर वी विल राइट डाउन यर our ip address of the raspberry pi and just afterwards it will display on your laptop screen and play now see username pi and password is raspberry pi same in the putty we use pi now so it has configured our raspberry pi now see the screen is there on your laptop so simple so easy if you will move step by step now you enjoy it do whatever you want to do make programming coding on your laptop simply put that raspberry pi in another room with supply cable sit anywhere and go ahead and work no need to carry this raspberry pi anywhere you can plug it in your house and any in any room you can control it from your laptop you can work with it now this is the youtube open make big screen the raspberry pi is at beside put it in any room and just work on it so gentlemen my dear friends hope this video might have been useful and informative for you as this uh, only with the raspberry pi without any screen you can display it on your computer pc mainly you need to download these things and wifi connections should be there and proceed keep your raspberry pi in another room and work it on do anything in another room so hope and uh, expect and i should say thanks for subscribing the channel and sharing it to the needy students through your friend circle so that it should reach to the needy students and preferably below poverty line and they can get the benefit of my this free education platform so thanks and see you in next video